Um, how, how detailed are these courses, Adrian? How, how equipped are they to hit industry once they leave here? Give us a little bit of the detail and certifications and maybe things like that. Well, it, we, we tend to go with more with an ISO-based co course. So it's all G-codes, M-codes of the traditional FANUC software. And then we move on to Manual Guide I, which is the conversational system. So this will prepare them for any machine, no matter what the age of a FANUC machine. And when you compare FANUC to other controls, then what else could you be sitting in here tomorrow showing people the Heidenhain system, the Siemens? Yep, we cover the FANUC control, Siemens control, and the Heidenhain control, milling and turning. We also do CAD CAM packages, things like and, that. And how would this course look? They're in here now, but do they go out to the machine? What's the mix of uh, what they're doing? This course is mainly on theoretical. We do a little bit on the machine just to show them the actual physical control, but the simulator will simulate that about 98% the same as the machine. But I do go on the machine just to show them around the control. How important is it for people to come and train here regularly to make sure that they're at the top of their game? Well, Fanuc and Siemens and Heidenhain are all evolving. So the controls are changing over the years. So it's always quite good to get a, an update especially if you have new controls and new machines.